Hello. Hello, everybody. Hi, everybody. I don't know. Enjoyed that. I don't know if I cut that off or not, but uh, there, there you go. go. Yeah, yo, yo. You can blame me for that. It was my idea. There you so go. We're doing the Parak animations, so it's only fitting. We're in 2006 now. And then oh, we spent yeah. like <laughs> seven months on Maze of Shadows, and now we're on 2006. Six cunning and brutal beings, the Paraka, travel to the lair of Makuta in search for treasure or new technology. What they found was a shattered armor of the powerful villain, who had apparently died in battle. And that suddenly all sister seized with the overpowering idea to seek out the ancient mask of life on the island of Oya Nui to take it from the Zells. Although some questioned the mysterious way, they decided on this at the same time, none doubted that the Kenobi Ignite would be his raw object of ultimate power. Wow. That Impressive. was way too fast. <laughs> Now the Paraka have journeyed to Voyanui in search of the mask, and Matanui help anyone who gets in their way. I remember watching this as a kid on the website. This I cool. didn't actually watch these as a kid. Yeah. From... I love the sort of comic book mm -hmm. aesthetic on these. Oh, and they yeah, jump out of the panel. Pretty yeah. cool. It's a bit ridiculous, but yeah. Great ass. That's great. And then and actual you... torture. Yeah. By just screaming. <laughs> just looking at him. Iris doesn't look. He just looks sad. Yeah. Oh. Oh, just shot him. Yeah. So there are many games in this. That's the reason. Basically, the whole reason why we played this gameplay. You just kind of pick the right rocks for this little. Uh, and it's it's uh, riveting. Yeah, and if you oh, you can game setting. over if you don't if you miss them. <laughs> Yeah, so oh, you can also is... you can also pretty easily skip them, but uh... here at Team Penelope, we don't skip the mini games and the rock animations. Don't hold me to that because that's seriously it's <laughs> gonna be very difficult. Bees. Oh yeah, bees. Forgot. Can we just refer to Zach Ten as bees? Yep. Yeah. I I've heard this joke so many times, but I have no idea. <laughs> We'll explain when we're not in a cutscene. Yeah, we'll, we'll explain when the uh, next the next okay. sort of interactive. I like thing. how it's just the same theme of time. Yeah, I actually love the depiction of the oh this one, yeah this one. Oh, oh yeah. This, this nightmarish music of uh, while breaking your mouse. Ooh. Yeah. So uh, before before we do this one, um, to explain a little bit about Zach Tan. Yes. Um, so he's bees. Yes, he can transform he, himself into like a million different no, he, like prototypes. They're he called. Can't, he can't transform himself. He just is. He is cursed with that. He just True. is. Yeah. A million different particles, essentially. He's not like yeah. a, a solid thing. It's because like. I mean, he can make himself solid, but he can also come bees. It's because like the leader of the dark hunters like shot him with his eyes, the eye beams or whatever, and he yeah. turned into like non-solid. So instead of killing him for some for no discernible reason okay. i'm just gonna blame greg and go with that yeah <laughs> that's yeah. fair okay now i'm gonna solve now... my hand a little bit for this um, all right i don't think so... we're gonna be able to get this one uh and you'll understand why in a second test boom boom kaboom blam blam boom blam boom 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 bam. boom boom blam ah. boom boom blam blam you, you, you seem to be I have 18 there. seconds. <laughs> yeah, 90. Oh, oh wow. Okay, Ooh. that is the first time I've actually done that, I think. Maybe a second in my life. Mm. Ow. <laughs> and the first time on stream. Wow, okay. It's always on stream, first time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> to be continued. Yeah, oh, this no. is pretty short. And I'm, I'm just realizing now, we do have a few new people and we haven't introduced ourselves. So. Oh, really? oh, yeah. <laughs> we always so, forget that. Yeah. We always forget yeah. That we do uh, I'm Desalius. I'm the environment <laughs> designer. And today we're playing some rock animations after we've already played yep. one. <laughs> now, Thok has discovered something interesting. Something he has no intention of sharing with his teammates. This is about like what the rock are all jerks to each other. Ooh. What does that say? I love the Western music here. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, go right on it. Has no ulterior motive. Oh, yeah. yeah, so we're gonna be starting Vnog afterward. I'm not entirely sure if we'll finish Vnog because I remember it being really kind of long and irritating. But I mean, same deal with uh, Monog too. So we might finish it. 
gun. Also, this is non-canon, just to mention. Unfortunately, yeah. is non-canon. This part is this part is super non-canon. What? I kind of hate it this though, because is... like this is really cool, and I wish that Why? it was canon. Mm -hmm. Why? Well, you'll, is this see, you'll see. You'll see. You'll see. You'll see. You'll see. Yeah, we don't want to spoil why it's non-canon. Oh no! Bonk. <laughs> Chain man. You woke up pookie. Right. I can't freaking, I can't see. And also, there's no music. I remember there being huh. music here. Yeah, it's probably, it feels like they're supposed to be. Like yeah. the At least games. sounds. I, I remember there being sounds. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, the unicorn says, I love how their personalities are showcased in these animations. Oh, definitely. Ah. If the hit just pushed you, pushed you down a little bit, and you still have a time limit, that's that's enough of a uh, detriment, you know. Yeah, but you know, Bionicle Flash games are notorious for being very hard, and like, how could you do this as a kid? I like right. Radax little shimmy in the animation. Yeah, climbing, like and it's for both. It's for all directions. Uh huh. <laughs> like oh, shimmy left, shimmy right. It's like he's <laughs> crawling on the floor. Yeah. Lab DG says, uh, no, I missed the part when Avak uh, blasts the mountain for fun. We did it first I time. Love, I just love that he does that as a hobby. When I saw that first time, I knew he would be my favorite. Yeah, we Very did slow. that spam click game that I could never complete first time on stream. As, you know, per usual. Complete I like the idea that... I require just, complete it's... silence for, for focus. Oh, all right. No music. Yep. Sil complete silence. Yep. If you, if you got 10 seconds of silence on your bingo card, then there you go. <laughs> I, li I like the idea uh, that... I keep running into that one. That there's just like no music or sound effects, and the other Proc are just standing there in complete <laughs> silence, watching Radak trying to climb up this wall and getting hit with the balls. That looks like... Oh, maybe made the it. End? There you yeah. go. Nice. Nice. Let's go. And everybody else just climbs up just as easily. Yeah. Lab DG says, nice, well clicked about the uh, shooting mountains. <laughs> Thank you. There's Holly. I'm pretty, I'm gonna, we're gonna try and actually finish this, uh, like each each one of them because like that, it's kind yeah. of a completionist thing, you know? Wait, hold on, what is that yeah. H? It says Holly. Oh, oh Holly. Let's see, yeah, some biofan says, if there was ever a Bionicle theme park, I would I would like to see a rock climbing park with large brick-built Radax statues. <laughs> yeah. I would like to have lots of just, like, balls I just, on chains. Yeah, just balls on chains that hit you and you fall off. So obviously this oh. isn't going to take very long. You have to spell Holly? Yeah. That's... Uh, oh! Ow. H-A-H-L-I, and then there wasn't any H. Oh. So H there was an A H L. Ah, there you go. See, this one's really easy for us here, Bionicle fans. Yeah. Read stuff. <laughs> yeah. So, Nightman just DM'd me on, on Discord, and, and he said, uh, the only thing I remember of Bionicle is the Mari, and he wants us to play the Mari games next. We'll get to... Well, well get not to, next, we yeah. Will get to, we will get to the Mari games eventually, but not They're pretty next. soon, actually, because, like, they are, um, after no, Boy and Nui, that's... Yeah. Pretty much the next thing. How many episodes are there? There's three, four, five, and six. Okay, well, we're already halfway done. Yep. Um, this is... <laughs> Be ready to read again. <laughs> Alright, I'm ready. While searching for the Mask of Life on Boy Nui, the Paraka discover a mysterious cavern. Their journey reveals it to be rigged with tricks and traps. But can any trap hold the powerful, evil Paraka for long? Evil. Evil. Not evil. They're very evil. They're just kind of jerks. <laughs> and also slavers. And also slave traders. <laughs> torturers. Yeah, they are they are kind of evil. <gasps> sure. <laughs> I guess that fits. Alright. Man, this is just like the wall shimming and trials of the great spirit. Hmm. Except they're walking on it, they're not climbing on it. They left him behind. Now he's going to be angry and, and shoot sh them. Shoot, with he guns. shoots the Xamar Spirit into literally the wall. <laughs> <laughs> just passed him into the wall. The the wall is now in the control of the Maguda. Exactly. <laughs> Living wall. <laughs> also, by the way, the only Paraka I actually have is um, Vazon, who technically isn't a Paraka, so... Oh, no, not this one. 
This is Ooh, most of wait. these get mini games. It's like, oh no, not this one. <laughs> <laughs> this makes sense to have a health bar though. Well, I kind of wish it didn't. I kind of just wish it slowed you down every time you hit one. Nightman says, uh, whatever happened to those <laughs> sets with the little bionicle? A I little, need me one of those. The little bi- the, probably the Matoran? I think he's talking about the Matoran, but I'm not sure. Oh. Yeah, these guys, uh, use them as slaves. Which now is great for your children's, uh, media franchise. Ah. As for- as for needing you one of them, uh... You can get them on eBay, probably, or, or BrickLink. Oh, you have to hold it beforehand. That's annoying. It jumps on the release. Oh, oh that's, that's... So to jump higher, you have to hold it for longer, which they give you the exact right. amount of time as any other ones to see that's that, to see weird. the higher one. Can you just like hold it down? like, the time <laughs> and, like No, because there are some that are on the ceiling. You'll get hit in the ceiling. Sir, sir, the unicorn says chrome dinosaur game from Baraka. <laughs> That's literally what this is. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, yeah, except it's much faster and less uh, less easy to predict. It's like level level eight of the the dinosaur game. This is pro dinosaur game. Yeah. Baraka are just professional dinosaurs. Apparently, this uh, apparently this mini game has some pretty good music. But it's not playing. I, I don't remember them having music. I remember them being completely silent except the sound effects. I'm trying to figure out what that um, the the health bar at the top right is made out of. You got the claw there. At the, the, the left uh, it's the there. it's the the Zamrosphere holder they have. Mm, like behind it's, it, I think it's like... styled like after that. I don't know. I can't really look well, at it right now. That's fair. That's... Yeah. Focus on the game. <laughs> All right. Ben Benego says another easy, easy in air quotes game for children. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I made Ooh. it through. What? <laughs> that was fast. See? Nice. Easy yeah. game for children. Okay, we actually are kind of completing all these, which is surprising. Oh, Pac-Man died. Mm -hmm. So has the non-canon part come up yet or no? No, um, that's like, I think that might be next episode or, or it might be the fifth episode. The really non-canon part. Yeah. Most of this is like... It could be considered canon, but it's, you know. And also, I love yes. how Hakan just fell in the lava and he's like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> he's the, the red one. So he's... Mm -hmm. Oh, what a conspicuous looking Also, rock. that would have actually that would have actually killed him if he had fallen into lava, so it was probably just a fire pit. Because, you know, he's not the Paraka of Plasma or anything. Well, they all have, like, weird powers, so I don't know what else um... Hackhands is. And now they're fighting. The soundtrack in this is awesome. As little of it as there is. It kind of sucks that the minigame music isn't working for us. Though. Yeah. Question. Why are the Toa and Ika masks in this place? That's the non-canon part. <laughs> right. Yeah. We'll see more about that later. Because they got those masks from Karzani. So. Yep. That's a cool transition. Ooh. On, on yeah. the bottom Ooh. there. Yeah, and then the flip around is awesome. Yeah. It's a lot of really cool stuff like that in these animations. Yeah. Oh, not this one. <laughs> Every time, not this one. <laughs> this is another spam click. I never understood. You just have to spam click back and forth to run faster. I guess. <laughs> you, you also have to yep. make sure you don't click the same one twice. Fast. Does that mean I'm going fast or did I have to go faster? <laughs> Hurry! Hurry! I'm pressing it! <laughs> you have to time it? Oh, I think you have to time it. Uh, you're, you're yeah, almost I'm dead. there. <laughs> I gotta move the mic over so I can actually click the button. <laughs> okay. Kumo Rock says, too bad Kongo was cheated with the wrong mask with Nupro. <laughs> okay, so can somebody in the chat tell me, is it timed or just, like, is it paced or is it just as fast as possible? Uh, LabVG says, the whole series may be pretty dang non-canon, but it's so cool and the closest thing we have to an 06 movie, so... I don't care how canon it is. That's fair. Almost there. Getting tired. Come on, get it. Ah. Oh. Okay, Ooh. so it is slow sort of pace, as long as you click the right ones in the right order. Ow, my hands. <laughs> hands are gonna be dead by the end of this. Uh, I really like how we have Balta just standing there. At the yeah, release. and then he just gets hit on the head. What is it with uh, Vinyl Quick Games and Matoran getting hit on the head? I mean, it's mm. an easy... <laughs> it's an easy, it's easy way to... <laughs> 
Yeah, it's an easy gag for one. Yeah. And for two, it's, it's not super violent. Oh, I mean, true. it is violent, <laughs> but it's not as violent as some other things could yeah. be. So it's, it's like sitcom violence. The Paracas disagreements escalate into open war. Well, as they journey to the caves in search of the mask of life, traps of fire and ice wait for them, and all the while, their journey without knowing that the Matoran resistance prepared for their arrival. Alarm devices built into the cave caverns are warning the Tor and Nika that the Parak are on the march. That's not, that's the, that's very not canon part of the set. Yeah, that's, that, was, that, that might also kind of be a spoiler, because that's not in this one, right? What, what was not canon about it? First of all, the, the, these the, transitions. Really cool. Woo. These transitions are non-canon? No, no, no. These transitions <laughs> are really cool, is, is what I meant. Okay. So what's non-canon about it? The Toa and Nika. Yeah, it's just the way they're introduced, mainly. Right. Okay. Oh, was it the Mask of Life just standing there? Yep. What? Nope. It was a trick. You just got Indiana Jonesed. Yep. But Radok is strong boy, so he just lifts it up and it stops crushing him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one's actually kind of fun. I, I just kind of wish it had music, though. Oh, whoa. Okay. Wee. And also, it's kind of hard to tell where they are, actually. I really wish that somehow I could actually, like, get some music up and, like, ready for these. <laughs> make them up. You can just make our own music. No. I'm not making my <laughs> own music. And I'm beatboxing on stream. <laughs> Pretty accurate. I had a guitar in there. <laughs> Some bio fences is kind of trippy. I agree. The way that it's like, yeah, does the 3D. It's done kind of well, it's... which is surprising. Like just the, uh, yeah. the amount of depth you can see. It has kind of like really smooth animation there. Yeah. Really neat. In Beam Up, is there a final boss? And if not, do you plan to add one? Says um... I was 10. Yeah. Currently, no. Yeah. But I'm not going to spoil anything. That's, that's what I'll say. In 2.0, I will say there's definitely going yeah. to be a final boss. Obviously in the final uh, game. But before that, mm -hmm. we're not going to say if there is or isn't. You're just going to have to figure it out on your own. Oh, he's frozen. Yeah. And so just to be clear, uh, Hakan and Thok are slightly behind the other one. So that's why yeah. they're just now doing this. Oh, dang. Thok going for the full 360. <laughs> oh, now they're just fighting each other. It's in open war, warfare, oh, wow. although they're only really fighting right act, but the other ones just kind of joined in. I think he's stronger than, than the mechanism. Oh, yeah, this is the uh, DDR one. Oh, what? Which I was never good at because it goes really, really fast. Why is everything in this game kind of stuttery? And that's just the that's the just the animation because he's and also, yeah, there's another one. Oh, wait, no, I did it first time, is so it? I don't have to do the other one. <laughs> that's just the Discord stream on our end, Daz. Yeah. All right, let's just pop up in the next one. Let's just keep going. I like this. The next one, it's it's cool. Let's hope that it actually plays the soundtrack. Poor poor Balta, gotta say. Yeah, kind of sad. Every time he gets hit on the head. <laughs> How many concussions does he have to endure? Alerted to the presence of the evil Paraka in the caves, the Toa and Nika prepare for battle. <laughs> With their elemental and lightning powers, Toa weapons, uh, hmm. <laughs> and masks of power. <laughs> masks of power. Yes. It would seem they are ready for anything. <laughs> but can anything prepare them for the Paraka? And lightning powers, apparently? Yeah. And lightning powers? And I, can, and I can have them. Ooh, this is now the Anika animation. Yeah, so this is the non-canon part, oh, yeah. the most non-canon part. Although I think it would have been a really, really cool way to actually do the story. I don't know how they would have like figured it in with the rest of it, but it would have been a really cool bit. Like they're hibernating oh, inside these. Oh, oh just come on. Right. The music. <laughs> Lab DG says, I think Volta got so many hits to the head that he ends up in a coma and Bionicle Heroes is just his dreams. It's the only way it makes sense. <laughs> That's that. I can see that. Are you trying to get the music? Yeah, I'm trying to get the music for this to work because this this song is too good to not have it play over this. Music. Some bio fan says, please put on Move Along for the game parts of the Anika and Paraka <laughs> and the Paraka rap for the Paraka. That I, I can get behind that. Two things. Uh, all these Anika for these animations, they hold their Xamarin launches in different ways, which is really cool. But it's like, if you try... It's weird because the Xamarin's spheres would all just fall out. Yeah, if you did that in, on the actual toy, the Xamarin's spheres would fall out. I'm, this is unfortunate that they don't have this one particular song. 
Yeah, it's it's one of the many technical difficulties that we on our on Team Kenohi are famous for on our streams. Did you just walk closer? Yes. Oh god, he's he's coming. <laughs> that's that's ominous. That actually, hold on, it's not supposed to be brown. Yeah, he's, he's not. Like, Gunmetal gray. Mm hmm. Yeah. This must have been oh, one. that's weird. Yeah. 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 Holly has pure silver armor here. No, like silver and like white. Because in her set, it's like blue and white mixed together. So that's another. Right. Oh. There's yeah. like some slight differences. So I'm Maybe guessing this all is the non canon stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just... Mainly the way they're introduced because, you know, they came to the island by the yeah. canisters. Mm -hmm. This has them already there in the like cave. Uh, yes. Kongu. Finnegar, <laughs> go ahead. Finnegar refuses to believe that Hoopy did not hatch from a rock. Um, no, no, no. He didn't hatch from a rock. He hatched from a coley ball. Okay. Uh, Lurking Carrier asks, so what in this game is supposed to be on site safeguards of the Ignite Cat? Uh, yeah, that seems about. Yeah. Kongu is my favorite as a kid. It's un I'm really sad that the music didn't work on, on these. Mini games. Do you want to do an interpretation of the music? Uh. I don't know. Go somewhere like that. Maybe I'll ask. Yeah, that's that's, that's really one. weird. Like the way Jalar holds his sword and <laughs> yeah, camera lock. It's cool though, and it also completely covers Kongu, so like <laughs> you can't see him. Yeah, all of them. They're like holding them. They're holding them backwards. <laughs> Also, I find it really interesting that the poster boy, as I like to say, is uh, actually Matoro. Well, he's he's the chosen one, so... Oh, right, yep. yeah. <laughs> Do they know that at this point, he's... though? They probably Not had it planned point. out. Yeah. Story. Yeah. Yeah, but, like, he's, like, the front man Ooh. this year, as opposed yeah. to Jala, who is usually... Or the, the top. Right, right. The red one. They probably wanted to break away from that tradition, and oh. Lego probably did know that he was the chosen one, so... Oh, yeah. I mean, in um 2006, Holly Holly was the poster one, but it makes sense because there was you know water. I guess they kind of did one like each year, like a different person. I don't know. It just really stuck out to me this year. Yeah, this it is. And it also kind of fits because like in the in the earlier years, it was always like, you know, Ooh. Bahu versus Papaka. Yeah, yeah. So like, which one's going to be the leader, sort of thing. Right, right. Yeah, I remember the game in this one cool. being unique. The Paraka are closing in on their prize. The powerful tell... mascot line. Only, only the oh. Tora Naked can hope to stop them. When these two mighty teams clash, all of Oyanui is shaken to its core. Ma the two will will <laughs> who will survive to go down the winding stair that leads to the chamber of life? One side will win. One side will lose. One side will fall. Yes, that's how one side fighting will die. works. <laughs> yeah. One will win, one will not win. Some biofans says, I'm gonna tell all future Bionicle fans that they are born. <laughs> They're running. Six uses the element uh, system established in Maze of Shadows. Uh, uh, oh, really? I really? Mean, not. I mean, it's just kind of a general element system, so I don't know if that's. Is it gonna be the same one? And... Oh, what? Oh, yeah. Also, yeah, teleportation. Okay. It, 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 is there a mask that explains this? I don't know. No? This okay, looks whatever. This like a straight up Final yeah. Fantasy fight. Oh, the music is working on this one. So yeah, it's basically um, oh. sort of, you know, everybody gets two lives. Uh, each element system oh. sort of goes against them. So like, if you can see on the right, Zaktan is powerful against water and stone, stone. and weak oh. against uh, ice and earth. And, thing. <laughs> and you also need to get these keys here to get to the, the gate. And now this points out all. that Radiax Zammer launcher is all messed up. Like, look at it. Oh. It's... Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, it's like pushed in. Why is it pushed in? Lab it's... DG says, let go of canon, just embrace the cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's kind of the that's, whole that's... deal of this animation sort of thing. It's like, mm -hmm. it's just cool, you know? It's a, it's a good time. Like, Even the uh, quality it's... requires line of sight. I guess the Olmec could do this, but that's less emerge from the ground and more emerge from dimensional rift. Right. I mean, I guess that could count. I guess the dimensional rift could be in the ground. What What if these aren't the Toa Anika? <laughs> what if the Toa Anika from an alternate universe? Ah, uh -huh. this is they had to come and in and save the mascot. That's why they came in through the rocks huh. instead yeah. of instead of the canisters. They had to come in to to save the uh, the mask of life because they w actually um, they actually got it in this universe. So so oh. so they failed oh, to get the just, mask of life. He just punched. 
Yep. He just punched him. So they failed to get the Mask of Life in their universe, and so they came to this universe to guard the Mask of Life in this universe so that the same yeah. thing doesn't happen here. Sure. <laughs> Lab DG says, uh, you get a different ending if the Paraka win. Yeah, I know. Hmm. I'm not gonna let that happen though, because I'm a good guy. <laughs> and I kick him in the face. He kicks him! Yeah, he kicks him in the <laughs> face. Says, after you play all the Bionicle games, will you try to speedrun them? Nope. Probably mm. not. Uh, so it's an Infinity War thing. Jump in from an alternate timeline to bounce the Baraka. <laughs> Basically. So you get the keys okay. and get to the door, and they can either win or you can win. But I just like to kill them all. <laughs> That's right. That's yeah. fair. Now, Bees are dead. dead. Bees are dead. I guess that makes sense why he's weak to ice, because you know he just freezes all the bees. <laughs> Who's weak to water? In the air. Yeah. It's Kill the him. other half of uh, Vazon. <laughs> right. So I like the lore behind. Uh, all the freaking Baraka have such weird lore. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. Zach 10 is bees. Vazok is h half of Vazon. <laughs> uh, it was really cool. Really neat yeah. stuff. Yeah. Silas Tem asks After you play all the Bionic games, what you will you stream next? We have, uh, we have some a list. ideas. Yeah. They're sort of going to be. Bionicle inspired, we're thinking. Like, um, Horizon Zero Dawn is very Bionicle like so in, how it, in its lore and everything. So, we'll probably go to Horizon Zero Dawn next. We could also do more uh, fan dubs of the Bionicle movies. Yeah, also <laughs> uh, reading some of the books in, in yeah. fan dub style could be good. We have, we have some ideas. We'll see. We have to we'll beat see. all the games, to finish all the yeah. games first. Yeah. We'll, we'll see what we feel like when we get there. Just imagine having four Toa Anika just <laughs> ganging up on you. Oh, no. oh Matoro, no. you died too soon. <laughs> he used up his one life against Rainneck. So that, he that's, why he, one. that's why he died in Maranui, because he used up his, his other life. <laughs> I like how they're all kind of like holding him at gunpoint. It's, it's Where cool. is it? And that's it. Oh, that's that's yeah. it. Yep. They you just be at the Paraka yeah. and leave him in the cave. And Tor just goes on to you know grab the mask of life. That's how it is. So yeah, they definitely knew Matoro was the chosen one then. Yep. And then you play Bionicle Heroes, yeah. which is the totally canon continuation. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it. Yep. That that's all the Paraka animations. Oh, wow, that was that was fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, we're just at the end of our first hour here. So the second hour will be the uh, Voyager Online game. <laughs> Lurking Carriers is... And of course, the Toa Code prevents them from permanently neutralizing the Paraka's threats. Eternalis says that, so you just be like Helrex and give the Toa Code the middle finger. <laughs> Here's the problem. Helrex has Mata hands, only has two fingers. She has no middle <laughs> finger. It's true. It's true. Your argument yep. Yep. is invalid. There's no way to give the middle finger. <laughs> Brilliant design by Lego. Good the job, tragedy, guys. the tragedy of the Toamata. Yeah. So we have uh, Vinog here, going away online game. Uh, so real quick, I don't know if this will save, and I don't know exactly how this game goes because I haven't played it in like eight years. Um, and I've never played it, so same here. Yeah. So this will be is... an adventure for all of us. Not entirely sure if we will finish this game because I do remember it being very long and kind of a bit boring. And this is just the version that I downloaded from. Uh... For eons, the floating island of Foyanui has been guarding an ancient secret. Okay, Hidden so. deep inside of the island's burning core is a Kanohi mask, the mask of life. So powerful that it may mean life or death for the entire universe. And uh, it's black and it shakes around. But a devious and powerful gang of villains called the Paraka have come to steal the mask. They've enslaved Matoru in villages of Voyanui and they're determined not to let anything stand in their way. Oh my gosh. Now six heroes have arrived on the shores of Voyanui to begin a mission that could very well be their last year of the Toa and their mission is to free the Matoru and discover the long lost mist of life. There. Yep. <laughs> the test goes fast. Why did the test go so fast? <laughs> One thing I know about this game is that it looks neat. Uh, the mask designs are right pretty there. neat. Yeah, actually. the mask designs are really, really funky, and they're, they're like very mutated and, and strange looking. The also, of the Mata mask. this game is very similar to um, the Island Assault in like the design of the Toa because like they have like the chibi hits, right? Which is kind of strange, uh, but it, it fits in a weird way. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, so <laughs> it's a lot. like. Uh... 
Maze of Shadows mixed with Minog. Yeah, so I don't remember if this is actually good or not, but <laughs> I don't know. Oh, no, 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 sorry. I, that, was, that was the wrong statement. It's Maze of Shadows mixed with Minog 2, which yeah. is even worse. Well, <laughs> but uh, what kind of toe you want me to play as? Should we go this with? Is... I'm, I'm a fire boy at heart, so I want to go with yeah. Jala. But... These are really, they look really... Cool. Really weird. Yeah. <laughs> I say Kongu. Kongu. Yeah, yeah. Okay. What What do you want my name to be? Kongu. Kongu. <laughs> don't <laughs> Don't break canon. All right. Don't break canon. The uh, key to Nongu. The key to Nongu. Yeah, I I can name him that if you want. <laughs> the <laughs> key to <laughs> no, name him Nongu. Nongu. This is This is who the key is to. No, I'll just go Kongu. Uh Welcome. I am Garon, one of the last free Matoran of Voyanui. We have been waiting for you a long time, Toa. But are you truly a Toa hero? I must ask you questions and learn the truth. Do you know why you are here? Uh, <laughs> We've come to defeat the last Matoran. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, which one? We're here to defeat the last Matoran. Let's go. I think that, I think that perhaps, one, yeah. Perhaps your unexpected arrival has confused. I'll ask again. Uh, we just... We tell him, hey, we want to kill you. <laughs> He's like, well, well let me just, let's just try something else. I'm here to help, I yeah. think. Very good. Do you, do you know where you are? I'm lost. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm on Mananui. Let's go. I'm on Mananui. Let's go. Oh, I'm on Mananui. <laughs> yeah. I've already told you the name of this place. Let, <laughs> let's try again. It just, I hate what how is it, this? It just quits you if you fail. <laughs> Uh, indeed, this is Island called Voyanui. You have come so far from your homeland, strange to Do you know what you're here to find? The Mask of Life? I don't know what we're looking for. Sources of Protodermis. Just... <laughs> what, what am I... Uh... We're I'll... gathering Protodermis on our... I'm coming Thanks, to the, the new land, and I'm, I'm seeking wealth. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Protodermis, Protodermis. Instead of, instead of looking for oil... Truly, really, you must be confused. Think hard, though. <laughs> then it is as I hoped. You, you have come and search for the fabled Mask of Life. One thing that can save the great spirit Matanui. I fear it will not be an easy thing to find. Why? Oh boy. <laughs> yes, and I can look at the map. This oh. is uh, where we are. Line of, line of sight needed. Yeah, okay, so basically, I just got a weapon. It kind of reminds me of Empire of Toa because they have all the different. Like yeah. types of weapons. Yeah. I have that huge <laughs> claw on my hand now. <laughs> oh boy. But I have some Silas Chen asks, what would you say the biggest differences between Bmop 2.0 and Legacy? Everything. Everything. Here's the ice pieces. You've collected the metal. Unfortunately I've lost the equipment and oh, I need to craft it. Come on. Uh defeat this Brahi. Yeah, it's one of these games. Where so where do you have to go? Over to the Protodermis Lake. I mean, hey, we we are we did come to this island looking for more sources of protodermis. I'm probably yeah. way under level for this or something, but you know whatever. Bo Box turret says uh, I was never never able to get very far into this game. Yeah. I never, I only yeah me me neither. I think I started it and didn't know what I was doing and thought this is boring and stopped playing it. I don't know if you gave me anything. Ah. Oh, he did. He gave me the oh. Kanohi of water. What? Uh, defense Kanohi of Water. Um, uh, uh, I get plus one rain okay. for that. Okay. First of all, so, that is a that is a pretty cool looking cow cow. Yeah. But um, okay, that's definitely not the mask that you had that you have at the start. Yeah. <sighs> Lurking Come carrier asks. Um. Oh. oh. Okay. Uh, lurking carrier. Oh, okay. Oh, you go. You go. Okay. okay, I'll go. I'll go. So we're, lurking carrier says, uh, "Were Gafna and Vermont ever canonized?" I don't. I don't know who so. those two are. It's the guys are fighting. I think. He did. Right oh, yet. Yeah. Just one shot. Yep. Oh boy, this is entertaining. Um, this is <laughs> not a very fun game. Uh, not really. Rock animations are fun, but. Uh, Proc animations were too short, and this is yeah. too long. <laughs> yeah. So, do you have to beat the lava? Yeah, because he's in the way. Uh, you can make distractions and stuff, right? What yeah. If, what if I just went over here? It said uh, diversion. Maybe a little bit closer. Diversion. No. Diversion. You have to get their attention. Oh yeah. Like... And then you run away. Come on, go run. <laughs> no. Oh shoot. He's going back. Come on. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's running. Here he comes, here he comes. Uh, run. 
no, 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 no. Come on. Go, 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 go. I'm going. Oh, wow. I made it. Oh, wow. Nice, nice, Duke. Ooh. Escort guy into the wood tunnel. So I have to defeat this you guy first. You have to do this the whole time. Here's the problem, though. How are you supposed to leave Actually, now? I no, I think I can actually get back to, um, I can get back to him by a different route, I think. Do we, do we want to play this whole thing? Because how long is this? <sighs> I think it's pretty long, given the like systems in this game. I don't like, remember. I don't think I've ever finished we, it. <laughs> we don't want to get into the habit of yeah not playing games just because they're not fun. Well, true. <laughs> yeah, but we also don't want to get into the habit of not playing fun games <laughs> and having to finish really really boring games. I guess I'm I'm worried. I'm scared this is gonna become another Maze of Shadows. Yeah, cause like <laughs> this directly after Maze of Maze Shadows, of Shadows is a little got bit good, scary. Though. Uh, yeah, it did it? I think it, it got, got at, it got, got the good last because level was pretty the, good. It got good because we were about to finish it, and it's like yes, we're winning finally. So I'm not sure because this we, we this like... feels a little bit too soon after um after Maze of Shadows. I guess we could probably um, but, but, save this but, for later. The thing is, we're, we've got three bad games to play. We got this game, we got Bionicle Heroes, and we got Bionicle Heroes GBA. Yeah, but at least Bionicle Heroes is kind of entertaining because like there's stuff to uh, do, and Bi Bionicle yeah. Heroes is actually pretty short. I would say Bionicle Heroes is better than this, or at least because there's more going on. In the chat, what's your opinion? What do you think we should... Uh... What do you think we should be um, playing? I I don't think we should be really skipping games if we can avoid it. Doctor says that there's nothing in this game. I played further and it's just more of this. Play this like through says looking carrier. It has anyone else online played? Oh no! Yeah, not this, this again. <laughs> People have beaten this game on I mean, on video. Uh, no. Yes, I'm yes, actually dangerous. yes, because yeah. uh, TTV did it. TTV played it, but did they finish it? I think so. Oh. Yeah, I, I oh. remember it. I'll check. Uh oh. Chapter 1. The Matoran Village. Oh, whoa. And there's Radak with no eyes. Oh, oh that's a weird picture of Radak. I feel yeah. like this is like missing another layer. Uh, it is. Yeah. So, so I gotta yeah, there's, go... there's three things you have to find. Lightstone, Power Stone, Lightstone. Wait, what? Power Stone, First... Life Stone, Lightstone. Life okay. Stone? There's, I need to find a Life Stone. Like this is a this is one of those games where like I respect it, but I don't want to play it. So yeah, the TTV finished the game. Fun fact: this thing is called a Nectan. Yes. And it's another fun case of eight different another things thing. being named the same thing. But no, this is Scout Nectan, and he's behind a tree. So. <laughs> Can't see it. He's behind a tree, so that makes him. <laughs> yeah, proves my point about it, him being different the lore because <laughs> he's behind a tree mm. it, my point was that i can't see him all right and there's like some uh, barrels or something here but i can't seem to like click on it properly dig it ice claw it distract <laughs> it no okay. maybe i don't know power stone there it is you found the power you found, stone you found one of the infinity stones ttv uh -huh. played it through but they use velika's command call so to access the teleportation yeah so like they basically they cheated i don't want to go through this officially i don't want to go this, through this without cheats because <laughs> this I like monog 2 is like or, or, uh wait wait, too long. wait 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 no we can't do it with cheats we can't use cheats we can do it off screen oh right yeah, yeah sorry mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. we gotta we gotta do it off screen guys i don't even know how to use the cheats for this game though that's the point <laughs> Um, well, we have research to do. <laughs> Some biofan asks, why does Voyanui look like a decent place here? Isn't it supposed to be a wasteland? Because, you know, I think... it can be an overgrown wasteland. Doesn't mean that's not a yeah, wasteland. Yeah, I, I think it's in a constant state of, like, flux, right? So mm -hmm. it's being it's being bow-rocked and it's being rebuilt over Hey, from the life stone. There you go. Back to Garon. Easy. Don't give him the infinity stone. Too late. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not too late. There. You haven't done it yet. I already hit it there. It's part of it's a linear yeah, you quest. Can turn around. Garen gets like how Garen's just hiding behind like yep. a rock. Here, you, you you got those items for me? Yeah, here you go. <laughs> Fight the Nectan and Guardian in the main village area. Yeah, okay. So and I got a life stone, which I'm gonna put on my crotch apparently. Um. <sighs> yep. Oh uh, yeah, I got oh, no. these things. Oh no. Evil people. Evil people, no. Defense Nectan. 
Some Biofan asks, what is an official game you're not wanting to play? This one. Uh, Matoran <laughs> Adventures and also this Oni. one. Oh, Oni's gonna play that. Oni wants to play that one, unfortunately. Oni, gonna... Oni just wants to play everything that we don't want to play. Yeah, so maybe we can offer, <laughs> this, maybe we can offer this to him. <laughs> he'd, he'd play it. Yeah, he'd have a good time too. <laughs> Uh, Short Garen to the wasteland. What? Oh, what? Teleporting ahead of me. The Paraka that returned while we were gone to Sentmore next time they were to find us. We must destroy them. No. Oh, yes. I have to go yes. to all those screens and destroy all the guys. That's fun. Good gameplay. Oh, I'm gonna right oh in the middle Oh my gosh, there's even more. <laughs> the menu to shoot stuff. Oh, come on. Yep. So, is, it, is that like heal? The repair Nectan? Uh, yeah, I think it shoots out a thing that heals people. <sighs> All right, well, some. I'm over here. Do I dare I'm make everybody in gameplay joke? Don't. We need to find a different joke for this game. Like, <laughs> <laughs> okay, I just poofs. It's weird that you have, like, the Nectan as the main, like, enemies, because I don't think they were, like, a big thing in, like, anything else, really. I don't know what the neck ten. I mean, uh, I obviously see are like little robot things, but like, I don't, dude, I don't know their lore. Is it sure? neck ten one with Paraka? Yes, that's the thing. He's like the the stars Paraka. Oh right. Oh. Huh. Right. They, they named it after him because he's like, oh, a evil warlord that like breaks things, and they want their gun to be named after it. I don't know. Lurking carrier oh, said had a big message, and I'm I'm too lazy to read it. So somebody read it. Uh, <laughs> I have to say, whoever made the decision to have a debuff platform plus two heal platform plus a damage absorbing platform in the first actual fight against Nectan combat platforms. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I know there are fights in this where there's like more than three people. Just imagine oh, when you have to wait for every single person. Uh, <laughs> some biofan asks, what's your favorite part of this game so far? I know we've basically just been saying negative things about it. Um, <laughs> that's gonna miss. <laughs> uh, it's, just, it's too similar to Maze of Shadows. It's, it's giving me flashbacks, sorry. It's got like, some neat ideas. It's like an RPG and you get items and stuff, which is pretty cool, and I'm dead. Uh -oh. My favorite part is just, yeah, the items, because they're cool in concept. The utilization is not great. Ugh. I think I've been, like, conditioned to believe that any, like, to ever, any time I see the word mist, then I'm just like, ah, because I don't, I, I, the, may the shadows. May the shadows will just discard all of us. Uh-huh. Hey, Daz, are you still awake? No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Daz just I, I, I was nodding off, yes. <laughs> You're falling asleep playing this game. So I think this proves that we should not continue this because it's just another Maze of Shadows. Again, I can respect this game a little bit more than Maze of Shadows because it does um, it does have a pretty cool atmosphere and some interesting ideas. But I think it would be good to call it this stream before we run into the Maze of Shadows problem where it's like kind of interesting at first and then it slowly goes very quickly downhill to uh, a bad time. Yeah. Oh, shit, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's already starting to go down hell. Let's stop when we're... To, to be fair, ahead. to yeah. be fair, I am just tired today, so... Yeah, but <laughs> I mean... can't solely be put on, on this game. You were falling asleep. <laughs> was I snoring? Can you guys hear no, me? No, no, no. Radak. Radak. Radak with uh -oh, no eyes. Shoot. Oh, so he actually does have no eyes. <laughs> okay. By a Radak. By a Radak. <laughs> One singular. Watch out, boys. It's a Radak. Yeah, maybe just the type of game. Oh my gosh, is that like, is that like blood? Uh, no. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I do believe that that was actually blood. Uh, hmm. Hmm. That's not right. lore accurate or the same for kids. <laughs> <laughs> this is one my uncle got edgy. Yeah, I've got to add blood. Yeah, this is pretty much as far as anyone ever gets in this game, because after this, they're like, that was cool. Uh, I don't really want to play it anymore. Each yeah. Mela says that he thinks this game is better than Maze of Shadows, and if we hadn't played yeah, that, you would keep going. Yeah, it is better than Maze of Shadows, but it's not an enough uh, better to actually continue. 
at some point in the in the future. Yeah, if we if run we... out of everything to play, <laughs> then this would be a good backup. Oh no, I'm dead. If we decide we need to torch for ourselves. Okay, so it looks like Radak does really big um melee damage, but at range he does a lot less. Keep like a good distance away from him. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. Uh, yeah. kiting, kiting him around here, uh, my Xamarin, which I will eventually run out of. And here we go. Melee zone he time. Him. Oh, he's dead. Oh, <laughs> he just you did collapsed. It. And I got all of his loot. Incredible! You defeated a Radak. <laughs> yeah. What all can right. I do now? Chapter two. That's what you can do now. This How many thing. chapters are there? I don't know. Presumably probably six. six. Yeah, yeah. Maybe seven if right. there's phase on. A difficult mission lies ahead. Yeah. See it. <laughs> I'm not. <doing> <laughs> I'm not going anywhere with yeah. you. I feel like we need to probably just this might be this is probably gonna be it <laughs> for Renog, maybe. Yeah. Unless we decide. Yeah. We'll we'll discuss behind the scenes and see what we wanna do next time. Yeah, here let me check on the uh, uh, list to see. So if we're not doing Vinog, then we have uh Bionicle Heroes GBA, Bionicle Heroes or Bionicle Heroes DS. So Bionicle Heroes is doing... <laughs> Yes. Uh, yeah. And One of those. Bionicle Heroes is for a while. So well, I think uh, <laughs> That was that. Oh, wow. Lurking Carrier says there are eight chapters, with the ninth being open world exploration with no further content. Great. Yeah. <laughs> that is a lot. Yeah. All right. Well, um, thanks for thanks watching. For joining us this week. Yeah. yeah. For all of this. This has been kind of a short stream. It always feels like a really short stream when the when we do two things because we yeah. switch halfway through and it's like, oh, we've only been doing this for like an hour. What? So, so, some like, fan asks, so you're gonna finish all those versions of Bionicle Heroes? Maybe, yes, we are. Uh, maybe. Yeah. That's I mean, unless idea. it turns into another one of these type of games where you sit still and wait for Definitely the animations to play. Definitely be finishing Bionicle Heroes GBA because that's my jam. It will at least never, finish like never, the full version, the very least. We never played a uh, Bionicle the game GBA. Yeah. No. Yeah, we started we, it, we, we tried, but we said that's we're done with that because uh, it was yeah. isometric with diagonal controls. All right. Well. Uh, until next time, then, uh, I've been Dezalius. Tired Dezalius. I've been Joe Cool1231. I have been Markle. And I made the great guide, guide you. Guide you. Yeah. One of these days, we'll get that perfect sync. Yep.